I want Anna back. She's made a choice. I owe you an apology. I fell in love with her. My intention was not to make you suffer. So where is the apology? You cunt. I apologise. If you love her, you'll let her go so she can be happy. She doesn't want to be happy. I love her. Boo-hoo. So do I. You only met her because of me. Yeah. Thanks. It's a joke. Your marriage is a joke. Here's a good one. She never sent the divorce papers to a lawyer. Now. To a towering romantic hero like you, I don't doubt that I am somewhat common. But I am, nevertheless, what she has chosen, and we must respect what the woman wants. If you go near her again, I swear I will kill you. You're an animal. Yeah, and what are you? You think love is simple, you think a heart is like a diagram. Have you ever seen a human heart? It looks like a fist trap symbol. Go fuck yourself! You go check a few facts while I get my hands dirty. She hates your hands. She hates your simplicity. Listen, I spent all of last week talking about you. I know all your little ways. Anna tells me you fucked her with your eyes closed. She tells me you're awake in the night crying for your mother, your mummy's boy. I could go on. Shall we end this? It's over. Accept it. <laughs> Cry on me. <laughs> now, just to clear things up, I'm not going to hurt you, but I am the kidnapper and you are... The victim. And that's just the way it is. It's okay. I've been through this before. Kidnapped before? Mm. I was 12. God, that's terrible. <laughs> it was a long time ago. So how am I doing? In the kidnap? Yeah. So far, you're not doing too badly. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> anyway, I'm just tying you up so you can't escape in the night. I know that. Because, of course, you would. Are you going to have sex with me? No. Isn't that what you brought me here for? No, it's not. <laughs> Didn't even cross your mind? No! Well, no. Do you have a problem with sex? Oh, so you're frightened of it. No! Nervous, I'm not nervous. <laughs> right, calm down. I'm perfectly calm. I'm just trying to explain that there are no sexual motives for my actions. <sighs> Glad we got that cleared up. So what did they do next? What are you thinking? Right now, I'm thinking I've been going to a lot of these lately. What? Dates? Not dates. Is this a date? This isn't a date. Funerals. Well, he asked died? Oh, um... Actually, that's why I'm home. Um... My mum just died. God, that's weird to say that out loud. I'm so sorry. No, it's okay. How did she die? She drowned, actually. Yeah, um, my mother was a paraplegic. I guess she was taking a bath and she must have slipped. Oh my God. Why are you crying? I don't know. I'm not usually like this. Well, what should we do? I don't know. I've only been to one of these. You appear to be the expert. Well, we usually say something. Uh, okay. Um... I'll go first. Didn't really know you, Jelly. Um, from what I understand, you're a, a good pet. A little bit of trouble with the vacuum cleaner, That's but... That's not funny. Jelly, you were a great pet. I'm so sorry about the vacuum cleaner. I am so sorry about that. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>